welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing good. So we're back with one sec. A Primark haul, of course, for big bags that are actually heavy and that is a workout to pick them up. Can I go in Primark and not buy everything in there? No, loads of new bits in this time. If you guys have not seen my new in Primark, then I'll link it up there. That went live. Wednesday, I think, Wednesday. Go ahead and watch that. Loads of pastels, loads of green. It's staying, which I'm very happy about. Lilacs, loads of different bits. If you're new here, my name's Lauren. Welcome to the channel. I'd love for you to stick around and hit that subscribe button. If you love fashion, food, bargains, Primark, then stick around because that is what I bring to you on this channel. And give this video a big thumbs up if you like it because it really does help. Also, I just want a preference. I've currently got a mirror behind the camera because my camera is broke so when I flip the screen up so I know that I'm in frame it it's not working so I've currently got a mirror behind you to make sure I'm in frame so if you ever see me like looking up I hope it's not too distracting I'm just making sure that I'm what I'm showing you is actually in the frame of the camera so yes let's get straight on into this I want to save that bit because that is fun and we will go in with this oh yeah so I found this one so if you are new here, I go to the Stockport store and the Traffic Centre store in Manchester. I don't go to the big one because I'll spend too much money. And this is where I found this little number. As you guys know, I don't try anything on until I sit down and film it for you. First impressions, I like to do it that way. And I found this, I showed this in the new in as well, ribbed dress with a collar. I just thought it was really cool that I had a collar and it's actually navy. I don't really wear navy too much, but I feel like it's a really nice colour to wear with white so I picked it up it's just a long midi dress with the v-neck I picked this up in a medium which is a 12 to 14 if you are new here I'm like a 14 to 16 but I know with these kind of dresses that I've got from Primark before I can kind of go down because a lot of the time they have like so much stretch that it's just like excess fabric so I went for a medium who knows if that's actually going to be a good idea or not and it was £10 they also had this in like a nudie colour but I just thought this denim jacket, like white Air Force or something, could be really nice. So hopefully that fits. We'll find out right now. Guys, I actually love this dress. Sorry if you can hear the rain as well. It's, it's the storm, so apologies. Okay. Okay. I actually love the navy as well. I think it's really nice. The neckline is really flattering, I think. And especially with a little bit of gold jewellery on there. I really like the size of it. I definitely picked the right size. There is so much stretch in this. So I would say if you're in between sizes, you could definitely go down. Like, there's a lot and it doesn't feel too tight. It's like figure hugging, but it's not too tight at all. We've not got the best knickers on, so we don't need to discuss that, but just fits the body nicely. On me, it hits just below my knee which love the white socks loss which is a nice length just with some trainers i think or boots i actually really like this you can walk as well you know on some dresses you like no it's stretchy enough to walk it's not see-through from what i can see i don't think i love this i didn't think i was gonna like this as much as i do but i think it's really flattering shape with this and then this Guys, I like this. Wow, I'm happy about it. Me and my dress, see me on, on the streets, strutting my stuff. Hopefully when I've got a tan, if the sun comes out in the UK, that would be great. It's actually, it's actually snowing now. Snowing, yeah. Great stuff. Oh, I then picked up a couple of bits for, from the men's section. You guys know I live in there. First bit being this Raiders t-shirt. I did pick it up in an XXL because I picked these up mostly for Dan, but then I'll wear them as well. Really cool, really simple men's t-shirt. This is from the Raiders collection. Like I said, obviously the Super Bowl has just gone. So that was £12. I then picked up Dan a cap, just a Chicago Bulls black one because he keeps taking my new Yankees one, £8. And then I got this set, which I just think is so cool. And it's the matching it's 
set. So we've got the, the shorts, the NFL shorts, and then we've got the jersey to match, which I just think is cool. That's more so for Dan, but I'll definitely wear that jersey. The Raiders is such a cool team as well. And that was £10. These were... Let me tell you. 14 and I got them both in a 2XL. Okay. What else have we got in there? And then we've also got the PS Brow Sketch Dark Brown. That's currently what I have on the brows. And mine's about to run out. So that's obviously why we've got that. Then I have a set of these drawers. I picked up the smaller version, which were these ones the other day I need to put my jewellery in and currently my makeup is just like bag 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 it's a mess so I picked up these for things like makeup and skincare so obviously this is the big wait which one's this I oh, know this one is that one these are stackable as well so this one was £10 I also picked up another small one which is the one I picked up the other day sorry and that was four pound but like I said they can just stack on each other it just makes it look a lot more clean and tidy which I'm definitely about oh really excited to show you this I did show this in the in as well I picked up two of the canvas bags I could not decide between the two so I had to pick up both this one just says good vibes it's a bit creased because it's been in the bag for a few days it's a little bit of a weird shape this one it's like a boat like look at the size of that and you think yeah it's not that deep it's like mary poppins or something in there you've got so much space i just thought that's really cute but i don't know if i prefer the other one this one was a five pound great colors as well that's gonna be really easy to pair with anything but then this is the one i saw first and i was really drawn to it again the navy i don't know what's going on the navy and the white and then obviously it just says Yale University I just think that's gonna be so cute really into tote bags right now obviously when I do content and stuff I take like outfits out and things again like these bags are huge like they're massive they don't look it but there's so much space in there and I think I'm actually drawn more to this one because I don't need both do I really this one was eight pound just imagine that with like leggings white trainers like you just can't go wrong i feel but very here for the tote bags they also had a couple of others which i think i showed in the new in as well so if you want to check those out go over to that video what else we got in here oh yeah i forgot about these did i want to relive my childhood i don't even know if i was in childhood but did i pick up a pair of dungarees Yes, yes I did. The reason being because I've just been wanting to pick up some dungarees for a long time. I think people make them look really, really good. I don't know if I'm going to be one of them people, but we're going to try it. I picked them up at a 14 and they were £17. So they're just this mid-wash blue. And then they've just got a bit of a rip on the knee and they're like a straight mum style. I kind of think, I don't really know. But I just thought, I don't know if I can make them work, but I really want to try it. So gonna try it I'm I really wanted to look cool in dungarees I think it's not working so this bit all nice and baggy loose on the waist but then they go too tight in of course the dreaded area of here there's not like they don't feel like they're going up properly so yeah love the color of them the length is let me just put you down a bit more like really good the length is great it's just like this is not working I just, wow i wanted to look cool in dungarees but i just don't think it's ever gonna happen like how do people make dungarees look so cool i mean i'd definitely rather wear like a t-shirt like this but just for the purpose of this video i just threw it on this but it's just not um it's not how i wanted it to look and i don't really know how to make it better right bag done okay let's get into it first thing in this bag is just a very simple like vest t-shirt pick this one up in black they had green they had pink they had nude i think this was so soft like when i touched it it's really really soft nice and thin as well so it's not like 
a proper sweater where you'd be too hot in the spring this is going to be really nice just tucked into some jeans or even in the summer just tucked into some shorts as well this i got in a large and it was only six pound i was going to pick up the green but it was a bit too bright for me i prefer like a darker darker green but it was still cute very zara all i'm saying is time off is coming for you zara so here is the black top can you see in the light there like the ribbed really nice Guys, tell me, does this cut suit me or do I look a bit broad in it? I'm not sure. Can you let me know in the comments? Because this is really nice and soft. It goes to here, which I could do with it being a bit longer, but, you know, it is going to tuck in if you want to tuck. Really nice and soft. So, so stretchy. I'm just not sure if I look a bit, like, broad in this cut. Could you guys please let me know down in the comments? Because I want to like it, but I don't know. I just feel like I look very boxy in this, so I'm not really sure... If I need it to be more like racer on me, I think I don't really know. Let me know. But it's got this in a million colours, so if it's for you, really nice and soft, I would definitely get it. And then I saw this on... Whose haul was it now? I can't remember. I saw this on someone's hauls and I was like, I need to find that. How cool is this? The great outdoors. Wow, nature. Just the black jumper. They also have this in like an orange washed out t-shirt. But I just thought this is really, really cool. I got this in an XL because I like my jumpers big. If you've not been here before, I like things oversized. And it was just £12. Really like it. Really nice loop back material. Yeah. Really cool with an all black outfit and then just that. And this just with jeans and trainers. Like you just can't go wrong, can you? Here is the black jumper and I just love this. Like you just can't go wrong with like a black graphic oversized. Like look, the space we've got here makes me so happy. If you've been here before, you know I don't like anything that's tight. It's kind of like a, a little bit like a bat wing kind of. Maybe it's just because I've got it like so big. But there is the, the graphic. It's quite like big on the neck because I have got it so big, but I don't mind that at all. So sorry about that. <laughs> Great. Thanks, hon. Thanks. And then if I just go down a bit, you'll see that it just sits just literally below my bum. But again, that is because I've got such a big size. But that, black leggings like I've got, big white socks that I've not got. I've just got training socks on. And Converse, just trainers, anything. So, so easy. Love this. This is going to go quick, I can imagine. So if you want it, I'd get there quickly if I were you. What else we got in there? I then picked up... Oh yeah, forgot about this. Saw this on Dion Crow. So I was like, need it. Really, really soft. Again, the materials that Primark is using right now, I don't know, but love it. And it's just a... Well... Like a half high neck. Body suit, really soft again. Jeans, shorts. I got this in a large and I got it in six pound. And I also have it in black, which I've left in the car, I've just realised. So that's fun. But we have that in the grey and the black. Really simple, really easy. Basics are just a necessity. Like, if you've got the staples, you're good to go. So here is the grey, like, high neck bodysuit. This material is really nice and slinky. You can see everything through it, apparently, so sorry about that. Um, really nice length on the neck. It's not, like, too high where you feel strangled, but it's nice that it goes up like that. Really slinky material. It's also nice and long. I can't show you, like, all the way down right now, but nice length. I've got a bit of space, and there's still some stretch in there, so it's not like, which some, some are, Really, like, it's not unfortunately a thong back. It is quite big, so you are going to be able to see it if you don't mind by that. And like I said, I do have this in black as well, but it's not with us currently. Do we have to say anything? Not really. I then picked up this mascara primer. My mum's actually been using this, and apparently it's very good. So thanks, Debs, for the recommendation. Two pound fifty. Not tried it yet, but hopefully we can see an improvement in the lash department 
And then I picked up these green workout leggings. Will I be working out? No. But I like the colour. Also, I'm running around constantly with work, so workout leggings are just perfect. They've got a lot of stretch, so we'd love to see it. I picked these up in a large. They were £10, and they're also made using recycled plastic. They, I know there is a matching sports bra to go with this, but they actually didn't have it, unfortunately. And it does have, I don't know if you can see that, a slight design to it. It's like a slight like animal print. I don't know, can you see in the light there? I can't see that far, I'm blind, so I'm not sure if you can. But hopefully when I do the try on, you'll be able to see better. Really stretchy, I'm hoping that these are going to be nice. And, and I just thought, go for green. We can wear it with white, we can wear it with black. You know, why not? Let's, let's do it. So here is the green pair of leggings. It's got a nice thick waistband. We do have a little bit of space there, but again, like the ratios of my body just don't work. The size 12 is just a bit too small. They're not as thick as I expected. I was expecting them to be a little bit thicker. They feel really nice. I've not got the best underwear on with them. I feel like if we bend, they could go a bit see-through. Not sure if you can see my neck is there, but you're welcome if you can. They're quite flattering, the colour's nice. I would just prefer them to be a little bit thicker personally. But I'm not mad at them. Here we go. Bag number four. First thing I picked up in this bag is something that's completely different for me, and it is this pleated skirt. I mean if you've been here before, you know, this, this is not really me. But the vision I had for this was big chunky boots, like a graphic tee, this beret in Paris. Just saying, or still tights if I wanted to do tights, high neck in Paris. I'm hoping to be going to Paris in a couple of months time. So that's what inspired this look. I'm not sure if I can make it work. It's quite thick as well, and it's, you know, when you get leather trousers and they're a bit sweaty on the inside, that's the material we've got there. But I would always wear a cycle short anyway. It could be too short for me, considering you guys know I'm 5'11". But we'll try it out nevertheless. They also did this in a really nice, like, cream leather um, colour as well. I got it in a 14, it was £10, and we've got a zip up the side, so who knows if that's going to fit. So no, I'm going to say it's a no straight away. The hips are doing the most. Obviously, I'm sorry about this camera angle. It's not the best, but the hips are just making it go out. So there is no way I could wear this out. It is just about covering the bum cheeks. Though I think this was going to look so cool on someone. For me, it's just giving too much like... I just, I'm just not... It's just, no. No, it's not, it's not for me. I really wanted to make this vision work and I think it would be cute for like a picture or something maybe. Look at that. My actual bum stops there. I mean, I would still wear shorts, but I just think it's not for me, but this is gonna look so good on someone and I can't wait to see it in a haul and it look absolutely banging on someone else but it's a no from me unfortunately i then saw this well this is actually one of the first things i saw when i walked into the shop and i was like that's gonna be really easy for spring summer time and the color well you can see so this is a shirt dress and it actually looks like it possibly might be long enough for me and us tall girls so i think you could probably size down if you're like petite and small i got this in a 14 and it was 13 pound it's just like a linen shirt dress, but when we try it on, we'll see how long it actually is. But it looks quite oversized, so I think you could probably size down. It feels really nice. Again, sorry about the creases. It's been in the bag for about four days, but we won't talk about that. Let's try that on, see what we think. I'm going to lie, look. This is really nice and soft. I can say that. It's cute. It is not as oversized as I was expecting it to be. I thought it was going to be like pretty... Big, which is not a bad thing like it's nice that it just goes more straight than huge I did think it was gonna be bigger it's a nice length though I definitely would have to wear shorts underneath it does drop down further at the back so you are gonna be protected I mean even if you wanted to wear it with leggings like 
you could do but I'd probably just wear shorts underneath just for those side bits there but it is cute I am not obsessed with it like I don't know what I was expecting it to do for me I don't know I thought it was going to be like I don't know really it is cute though legs here a bit short on my arms but I'm a massive gal I was just thinking as I was about to get changed you could just wear it as more like um, an overshirt as well if you wanted to with open just with like something underneath like a little white top of some sort or whatever you want you could definitely wear it more just like an open shirt if you really wanted to just thought about that while I was getting changed so I just wanted to share that with you so another pair of workout leggings I just got a pair of black look at the thickness of that um what is that called waistband waistband got there in the end look at the thickness of that they're feeling very secure and then they've just simply got this detailing again I don't know if you can see that far detailing down the side hopefully they feel quite stretchy as well but also that they're gonna keep you in there so they were six pound and I got them in a large just need some like more leggings and stuff you know to wear running around day to day at work guys look how thick this waistband is that is delightful it is slightly big on my waist but i have tried the mediums on before in the workout stuff and it's just a little bit too tight so yeah these fit really nice they're nice and stretchy i've not got the best underwear on with them at the moment so we're not going to discuss that but they feel really nice are they see-through i think mm, not from what i can see can't wait to edit this video back and it be completely see-through i like these they're a nice length too on me if i just go down you'll see like they're actually really nice i like them that waistband though is really what's giving me life they don't feel too tight where they're like but they also feel like they're not going to fall down every two minutes. Okay, Primark. I'm happy with them. We've got a grey hoodie. And who doesn't need a grey hoodie? You know what I mean? This I got in a large and it was 14 euros. So £12 maybe, ish. So, so soft. So soft. Really simple. Really easy. I don't actually own just a plain grey hoodie like this and when I see on Instagram these girls, okay, just wearing all grey and then a black coat and trainers, it just looks so sleek. I love it. So I needed to get on that. It does have a little bit of detailing on, so we've got the seam like you can see there across the arm and then we've got a pocket, we've got a hood. Again, I think this is quite oversized, so you could probably go down if you don't want it as big, but really nice and soft hoping that looks good on can you go wrong with a simple grey hoodie i think not we've got the space we've got the length on the arms and on the hoodie it goes down to a nice length it just covers your bum if obviously you get a bigger size if i was smaller you guys would probably get a lot more coverage really simple like there's not loads to say about it really nice and soft on the inside it is that proper loop back material it's going to keep you nice and warm get a black coat on over this get a body warmer get anything simple yet yeah, those are the pieces we love the most so i'm very happy with my new gray hoodie okay and i really did save the best to last this was is it my favorite this is possibly my favorite thing in the haul okay If you guys have been here before you know i've been loving the green trend this is giving me wimbledon and i'm absolutely not mad one bit about it you know what i mean so striped shirt green and white love to see it really thin gonna be great for spring summer i mean you girls if you get it big i could probably wear it as a dress i'll probably wear it with shorts or cycling shorts or even open with jeans i love a shirt if you've been here before or if you follow me on instagram which if you don't Please, I would really appreciate it if you do. Check shirts, corduroy shirts, shackets. Like, I am a shirt kind of gal. 
this was £11 and I was going to pick it up in the 14 but I like my stuff big big like I just said so I actually went for a 16 and just just went for a 16 really but I'm obsessed that's so cool no if this looks horrible on me I'm going to be really upset but can you go wrong with the shirt I suppose it depends on the fit obsessed with this let's try it on please look good on me please alright I'm just me in my green shirt I'm glad I sized up in this one because I feel like I like, you know me, I like to be spacious. Again, arms aren't the best. Like, I mean, they're fine when I've got my arms down. If I bend, obviously, they're going to go shorter. Love this. This is not as long as the, the line look, so it's definitely more of a shirt. But still, you could definitely wear that with cycle shorts. It does go longer at the back. I just like it. Does it do anything for my figure? Not really. But would I wear this with jeans? Yes. Would I wear this with denim shorts? Yes. Would I wear this open over a white racer with jeans or leggings? Yes, I would. And that's probably, I mean, I know I've not got a white racer on now, how I would actually style this and get the most use out of it with it open over a t-shirt of some sort. Love the colours, like I said earlier. This one is definitely staying in my wardrobe and I'm very happy about it and I can't wait to wear it. So guys, that is the end of today's Primark haul. I really hope you guys enjoyed and it wasn't too distracting with the camera situation. I'm trying to get it fixed as soon as possible, but it's not that easy when you don't have money coming out your ears. You know what I mean? So if you did enjoy, please do give it a big thumbs up. Like I said, if you're not already, Hit that subscribe button down there. I'd love for you to join the Army fam. And I will see you next time for more videos. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.